hard to describe. I was a police officer, a police chief for 28 years of my career, and so I'm very familiar with some of the emergency services stuff. But when you deal with the fire department, particularly one that's, that's largely volunteer or part time, uh, it really is just it, it's just tragic because these guys uh, and girls they all have other jobs, a lot of them, and this is their passion. They do it because they love it. They do it because they want to keep people safe. And then to see someone's young life cut short uh, is just tragic, you know. So as the manager, uh, you know. It really is just unfortunate. It's like the worst nightmare. You can't prepare for it, and it's just unfortunate. So the best thing we can do is make sure that the family is taken care of and that our employees are supported because it's a, it's a very tragic and emotionally emotionally challenging event for those involved. And, uh, and then the other one is just for the spouses, uh, the spouses and even down to the dispatcher that's on the radio. Those are all people you need to take care of situations like this and so we're just here but like I said Abbey is a small town but you know I know that the president of the community college will be here shortly we have a lot of people from town that may not be able to make the funeral but they want to be able to show up here and show their respects so we wanted to do this for them just to say thanks we remember you